Hey guys, welcome to Easy Peasy Redstone, a tutorial series where I do not want anything weird to happen. No funny business, I just want a normal intro, please. We're good? Alright. So anyways... Uh, <laughs> Alright, so, what are we making today? Today we're making a Lamp Block Update Detector, or Lamp Bud for short. What does it do? Pretty much what the name implies, okay? This redstone lamp here will detect any block update that happens right next to it, okay? Any block update. There you go. Now, you can turn this into a T-Bud as well, but a little more on that later. For now, let's, uh, let's build this thing, okay? So, let's go! And I lied. <laughs> One more thing be before I continue because this is really important, okay? This design right here that you're looking at belongs to XRush101, all right? He, when I when I saw this, I immediately thought of my kind of underground T-Bud because um, it, it wor basically works the same way, except that he had the brilliant idea of using a detector rail to divert the wiring as opposed to how I did it this okay it makes it one less short that's awesome okay and second of all um because this is very similar to my kind of underground t-bud uh it, it it sort of gave me the idea to make this a little bit more lightweight and actually one less long so that's what i'm going to show you how to make but uh you know we got to give credit to x rush because he came up with this and second of all you know seriously guys go to his channel check out his stuff he has a lot of great stuff and and I don't understand he only has 355 subscribers I don't know why he should have a lot more so so please really go check out his channel and and you will not be disappointed if you see his other videos so uh, anyway big big credit to him because um, it gave me the idea of using this <laughs> to redirect the wiring now uh, I suppose no. Let me just build it from scratch. Now here, here is the a little bit tweaked version, my version of it. Um, so whoops. So basically, you pl you place the two redstone lamps, piston on top of there, um, torch, dust block right there, and what you're gonna do here is actually place a repeater and a block right there dust right here it's gonna redirect the power back to this block here which we're gonna use to power this piston and detector rail and here you go now you have your bud lamp okay now I did mention uh, there's a way to turn this into a T bud very very simple set that repeater to two and that is it there you go okay now what I'm gonna do is there is a way to make this a truly underground T-Bud. Remember, I couldn't figure that out before. x figured it out. So I'm going to put a link in the description to that video because he shows you how to make this. But at the toward the end of the video, he also shows you how to, how to make it downward so that you could put it flat on a flat surface. OK, so uh, there's going to be a link to that video. And I'm also going to uh, give you a link to his channel. Guys, seriously, again, go to go to his channel damn it and give him some love because he deserves it okay so that's it that's it for for the uh, for the bud lamp and uh, and one last note you can also use this as you know this is basically this is like an updated version of my of my uh, T bud of my my kind of underground T bud because look at this you can use it as a regular T bud so there you go all right again go to his channel blah 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 I already said that <laughs> and uh, go away Wait, wait, but mischief, where's the output? Hello? Hello? Anybody home? Think, McFly, think! Come on! There you go. <laughs> Alright. Happy?